everyone and welcome back to my channel if you're new here you're welcome and i hope you all are doing well so for today's video i'm going to be showing you how to make this beautiful coily hair that you can use for your butterfly locks or for passion twist so with that said let's go straight into the video okay so to start i'm going ahead to take a little bit of hair and i'm going to take my comb and comb down through to make sure it's tango free for the next step okay so now that that is done i'm taking the stick and i'm going to uh, begin wrapping the hair around the stick but first i'm going to go ahead to twist the stick just like twirl it around to make sure i have that uh tight hold on the roots of the hair kind of you'll see in a minute just take that and twist it around just like that so that kind of twist the base of the hair so now that that is secure i'm going ahead to pinch that in place before going ahead to wrap the hair around the the stick so what i'm doing i'm twisting and wrapping the hair around the stick and making sure to wrap it tight and close together so if you want the coils to be a bit loose then you need to give space when wrapping the hair around the stick so as you can see right here you see i didn't give any space so if you want that loose texture um, coils you need to give space on the stick okay so you want to wrap it for a little bit so next you want to take your rubber band and secure the top in place so just wrap the rubber band around the uh the top so this will help to prevent it from unraveling while trying to wrap the hair the rest of the hair around the stick and also this will help to prevent it from unraveling when pouring the hot water on the on the hair okay so once that is done you want to go ahead and continue wrapping the hair around the stick by twisting and wrapping around twist and wrap it around twist and wrap it around so this will give you the kinky texture coils so if you want again if you want that loose texture coils then you need to space it out when wrapping the hair around the stick so just give a little bit of gap so once that is done again you want to take your rubber band and secure the tip or the end in place too as you can see right here so that way when you dip the hair in hot water it won't unravel so go ahead and repeat that same process on the rest of your hair until you have the exact amount you want for your for your hairstyle so i went ahead and did the rest of camera as you can see right here i'm going ahead to pour the hot water in the bucket with the hair inside the bucket and be careful this is hot water you don't want to dip your hand in hot water just use the stick put on gloves whatever you need to do to not touch that water it's hot okay so you want to let the hair soak in the water for a couple of minutes before pouring the water out or before taking the hair out of the water so next you want to take a towel and dry off the excess water so the next step is to lay the hair air dry overnight so you want you want it to dry completely before going ahead to unravel the coils okay so once the hair is completely dry then you can uh, take off the rubber band and then unravel the coils so one thing i forgot to mention earlier is that you need to break off the pointy end on the stick because you don't want to poke yourself with it you don't want to accidentally poke yourself with it so you want to make sure to break break off the pointy end before going ahead to use it <laughs> so i actually poked myself with the pointy end i was like all right it's fine i can i can walk around there no please make sure to break off the pointy end before going ahead to use it so that way you won't scratch yourself or poke yourself like i did okay so uh, we want to be safe about it 
so yeah <laughs> all right guys so this is the final result right here love it So you can use the hair for crochet braid, fashion twist, fashion braids, butterfly locks. Yes, that I'm currently rocking butterfly locks. And I want to say thank you all so, so much for helping me choose the size of the butterfly locks. I'm going to be posting the video very soon. So stay tuned for that video. Okay, so this is it for today's video. And please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you find it helpful. And also, if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. If you already subscribed, thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for popping by today. And I'll see you all in my next one.